Hello, friends. This Hello. is Mark. And this is John. And this is Rock My Bean. Thank you for joining us. Another Rock My Bean episode where we review all things drums and drummers and percussion. Yeah. Uh, I'm a drummer for 50 years, and Mark's been oh, about three and a half, about three years. I'm his instructor. Mark's on the autistic spectrum, which presents his challenges for both the teacher and the student. But Mark is an inspiration. He is talented. He's going to be a good drummer, and he's good now. And yeah. He's going to get even better. So this show is all for him and about him and people like him. And as a drummer, it's just fantastic to see. That's, give me, uh, that's giving me an idea about uh, the word inspiration. You, my inspiration. Oh, the Chicago song? Yeah. yeah, yeah. <laughs> that's for you. Yeah. Well, today, what are we going to do now? What are we going to talk? Who are we going to talk We're going to talk about uh, Nicole McBrain from... No, uh, we did, aren't we? did that. Uh, Who are we doing today? We're going to talk about <laughs> Lee Pearson. Lee uh, Pearson. Well, Lee. tell me a little thing, few things about Lee Pearson. Okay. Tell the audience a little bit Lee about Lee Pearson. Lee Pearson is known as a, one of the most vi vibrant drummers and electrifying drummers <laughs> uh, of today. He plays Lay's. He plays lays with some of the finest uh, names of uh, in music, from Broadway mm -hmm. to t t jazz mm -hmm. to hip hop. Yep. And I don't be. He maintains the classic vocabulary of percussion. Mm -hmm. Lee Person, a Baltimore native, began playing drums uh, of the age of two. He started Woo! at two years old. My goodness. His, his parents like Lee is S.R. Mm -hmm. and Judith Pearson bought his first drum set at the age of three. Wow, where we leave off here. Okay, yes. Um, he's recorded with such great musicians as Hank Jones, Roy Hargrove, John Hicks, Kenny Barron, Christian McBride, Mike Stern, Peter Bernstein, David Murray, the World Saxophone Quartet, Roy Ayers, Ronnie Laws, Lonnie Liston Smith, Wayne Henderson, Tom Brown, and Harriet Blewett. Uh, he's done recordings. He's done session drumming. Uh, yeah, he's just done a ton of stuff. This guy is really, really talented. And we're going to watch him do... This is our segment, a new segment called The Most Unusual Drum Solos. Mm -hmm. Now, we've heard, we did a, a drum solo of uh, Terry Bozio playing all cymbal drum set. Remember mm -hmm. that? Mm-hmm. This is going to be totally different, but it's going to be cool. It's going to blow your socks off. You got to see this. Are you ready to watch this, Mark? This yeah. is incredible. Yes, blow my socks off. Let's I'm... blow your socks off. <laughs> Are you ready? Here we go with yeah. Lee Pearson on the drum. Let's get to it. Now. <laughs> Yeah. Oh, that was cool. What? He was doing this. He was putting the stick on the drum head like this and playing it like this. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> boom, boom, boom. Yep. Yeah. And he goes, bang. Yes. <laughs>
One stick. Doing this. It goes. Shakes it out. Yeah. sticks here in a minute. Here's the bamboo sticks. They're kind of like brushes, yeah, but they're not as, as quiet. A little, a little more uh, uh, It's kind of buzzing? Yeah. Yeah. Wow. <laughs> what might appear? <laughs> dynamics. Mm -hmm. You notice he's doing dynamics here? I'm gonna talk to Mark about dynamics. He's doing dynamics in his drum solo. Uh -huh. He's bringing it down, and then he's taking it up loud, and then he's coming back quieter, and then he's mm -hmm. taking it up loud. The dynamics are so important in any mm -hmm. drumming, and uh, you'll hear some of the best drummers, like Benny Greb and stuff, say that. Mm -hmm. Man, it's it's not how hard you play; it's the way you can get louder and softer. Yeah, it's very hard. It's like a song. Oh man. <laughs> now he's going to play with his hands. Best day. 
Any chance to put it? Ah! Wait, 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 oh my gosh, check it out. What if I could do that? Your hat is too slippery. Hey, check it out. Now, can I play drums doing it? No. I don't think so. Stick? Oh! He did. He, oh, he dropped it. He caught it. Okay. Look at him. He's playing behind his back. Did, 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 did. Oh my god. Check it out. Holy smoke. Wow. Oh my god. That's just impressive. Oh my god. I hate it when drummers set the bar even higher for me. Yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah. Impressive. Super impressive. Very impressive. Yeah, that is just... And who is that? That's the band he's playing with. Oh my gosh, that is just freaking amazing. Okay, folks. <laughs> I wish I could play like this. Lee, me too. Lee Pearson. That was just, wow, out of this world. I mean, he balanced a stick on his head while he was playing. Yeah. And then, I mean, this is the most important thing. Impressive. Both hands behind his back and he was hitting the drums. Yeah. I mean, I can't even get my hands halfway. I don't know how he did that. That's amazing. Incredible. Yeah, it's think? amazing. What do you think of that, that solo? Oh, that was stunning. Yeah, stunning is a good word for it. Just impressed. This guy has incredible talent, and you can see he did something completely different with the drums. He didn't just play the heads. He played the, the sticks, the rims, the shells, the cymbal stands, the cymbals, and uh, used he used bamboo sticks. He used his hands. Uh, just amazing. Absolutely amazing. Yeah. Well, folks, that's all we have for this uh, this show. I hope you've liked it. We're, we're trying to do some unusual things that drummers do, and there's so much cool stuff out there for drums. Just like this. This is just this is top shelf stuff, and you know, you just don't see it every day. But guys like this inspire me and inspire Mark to be better drummers. You can always do better, you can always play better. My yeah. gosh, you know, it, when I was a kid. Uh, John Bonham came along and raised the bar. Then Neil Peart came along and raised the bar. Now you got guys like Lee Pearson who raised the bar. Yeah. I'm not even sure I can even get over oh, some of those bars. Oh, there's even uh, uh, a guy who plays uh, the drums with uh, paint and fire. Oh, my gosh. See, there you go. Now, it's stuff like that. I mean, how do you play with fire? Oh, my gosh. So, there uh, that you go. Would, uh, that would even burn your hands. Yeah. I mean, it's dangerous. Well, folks, that's all we have for this show. We hope you like what we're doing. You hope you have any comments, please leave them behind. If you uh, like our video, please click the thumbs button. And if you have any requests, we'll be glad to watch whatever you want us to watch. So, Mark, what should they do after saying subscribe like? Subscribe to, uh, to uh, uh, hit the subscribe button and hit the notification, notification bell. bell. If you don't, you won't get notified of videos. That's right. We do them. <laughs> we do them. Try to three times a week if we can. So please subscribe, and we will see you again next time. Next time. Bye-bye. See you later.